Hey guys, welcome back to Final Fan to Let's Play Final Fantasy IV Zero Gears Misadventures. Last time, you just saw my epic battle to the death with the mighty Octomom. And now... Ah, sweet sunlight. I am off to Dampsian. If monsters would leave me alone. Not a big deal. Now, um... I'm gonna do something that might seem a little strange. I'm going to de-equip Tella of all of his armor. But I will tell you right now, it is not because he's gonna die. Tella's not gonna die anytime soon. This doesn't look good. Oh, man. You gotta be kidding. Oh my god! Oh, bummer. So, anyway, I unequipped Tella of his... Oh, they took the crystal. The Red Wings, those jerks. I'm glad I'm not working for them anymore. So, anyway, Tella, he, I, equipped all, I unequipped all this stuff because, although he won't be dying, um, I'll tell you right now, he will be leaving my party. I spoiled that, like, a minute before it happens, so don't s just... Okay, sue me. I don't care. And the best line in the entire game. In a second. Please, listen. And here it comes. You spoony bard! Oh, that's the reason why I play this game. You spoony bard. I will probably... No, forget that. I will most likely use that phrase in many other LPs that I do. Shut your mouth. Along with, um... I'm not going to be doing this for an LP, but, um, Dragon Warrior. Anybody remember Dragon Warrior? The But Thou Must. Ah, I remember But Thou Must. I'll probably be using that one, too. Only when the, only when the time arises, of course. It's not one of those things that I'm going to be going around saying to everybody. Only when the time is right. But, yeah. Dragon Warrior. Great game. From the what? Arrows? You guys just got bombed the crap out of. What are you talking about arrows? I mean, look, there's soot everywhere. Not an arrow navy or sprite to be found anywhere. Not that there'd be a sprite for arrows. Oh, the first time in this game that we hear sad music. And we get introduced to the bad guy of this game, Golbez. Now, I like, um, this is a really bad place to introduce Golbez. I like in, um, I like in future translations of the game where, I think it's the DS version where Edward says he is a he is an evil fiend clad in the armor of the deepest night. I just love how greatly worded that is. It makes him sound so sinister and evil. Tears will not bring back the dead, boy. I'm going to avenge my daughter. Tella, you know avenging anybody out of hate is gonna end up doing something bad to you later. Instant karma, dude. I don't believe in karma. But, see, you can't go alone. You need us. Aw, oh, dude. No need to hit me. Bet you broke your hand on my helmet of whatever helmet this is. Darkness, I think? Yeah, darkness armor. Sob, sob. Grown man. And the little girl... What a gutsy move, Rydia. This is why she's probably my favorite female character in this game. 
She's just so gutsy. You're a grown-up. You're not the only one who's lost loved ones. Stop crying. I have. What, until you die? Of brokenheartedness, dehydration, or starvation? One of the three will kill you. You're not the only one who's sad. Anna won't be happy if you do that. Oh my god, Woolsey, you are killing me. We really need your help. Yeah, we need the help of a spoony bard. I am Cecil. I guess that would have helped you earlier. I need your help. I help you? Yes, you. I don't know. Can you give me a night to think about it? She seems like an important person. You shouldn't lose your loved one. You're one to talk, Edward. And I guess that's pretty gutsy on your part. Yep, we've learned of this information. Shall we just go? Well, how are we gonna do that? I'm wearing armor. Pretty sure Riley is too young to know how to swim. And you're probably gonna leave us here. While well, you go get it yourself, right? Oh, but there's a hovercraft at Dindampsian. As far back in time as we are, we have ancient technology that allows us to fly with no records of this in our present that would have helped us to create, that would have helped the Wright brothers to create the first plane X number of years ago. Yeah, let's hurry, dude. Prince Edward joins as a bard. Now I love this. It tells you that in the advanced version. It says Prince Edward joins as a bard. But then, you go to the, um, you go to the, uh, you pause it, you go to the, um, what is that? The main menu. And it, his description, it says priest. Priest. Oh my god, I'm losing it today. It is late. Um, you go to his, um, you go to the main menu and you look at his description, and it says Prince. Prince Edward joins as a bard. Um, no you don't. So, um, where was I? Okay, so this is the hovercraft. Pretty neat. Oh, that's right. I want to be. I have to go back to Dampton for something. Now, do you guys see why I unequipped Tella? Okay, there's a secret. Um, I don't know if it's a secret. Some people know about it. Others don't. Well, I guess that would make it a secret technically. There's a secret compartment back here. The basement. I lost my sight. Are you my allies? Yes, we are. No. For real, we're, we're the good guys. Keep the treasure inside away from the enemies. Okay, um, how would you know if we were the good guys? Press this button to reveal a secret walk through. Go through here, crossbow, off your helmet. Uh, go down one more, another secret, ruby ring. Um, I don't remember if ruby rings are as useful in this one as they used to be. Is there on the other ones, at least. Um, I think they might be better. I mean, than an iron ring, probably. Check the pots. They know things. Ether. Life. 200 GP. White arrows. Iron arrows. Now, when you find arrows, you're going to find them in a bundle of 10. Just to let you guys know. So, that means we have 20 white arrows... Ha, <laughs> Edward, I do not want you right there. I want you down here. I can keep an eye on you in the back row so you don't get killed. Yeah, Edward is basically pointless for this game. He's at level 5. You only get him in your party once. It's... He's, he's, he's a spoony bard. He holds true to that title. And I stick by it. But, you know, his equipment can't really be argued with. Um, give her a ruby ring if they're better. If not, I'll put an iron ring back on. Yeah, iron ring's better in defense, but as far as magic is... Nah, okay. Eh, it's useless. Um, I'll give Edward then. I'll give him my... I'll give him Tella's iron ring. Yeah, swap out some stats there. Um, he'll probably live a little bit longer now. Uh, fix up some of my stuff here.
No, I'm gonna do this. Okay. All my consumables on the top, and I hate this computer. Ugh, ugh, I hate that. Okay, so I'll probably be signing out for now, guys. Um, have a great day. This is Zero Gear Plus. Uh, let's play Final Fantasy IV, Zero Gear's Misadventures. Signing off. Again, have a good day.